I hope you will enjoy it and you will be happy to see the Holy Land. Church it was built at the 4th century AD, Byzantine Church. This church it was destroyed in 614 by the Persian. Persian, they came from the area today more or less, more or less, not the same. Iran area. Mm. Persian, they have Iran and the other country more than this. Okay, not what we know today, the country. All that area, it was the Persian, they came from there. And destroyed all the churches in the Holy Land it was built. Only one church that was not destroyed, the nativity in Bethlehem tomorrow, I will tell you the reason why. Okay? Yes. But remember that year, 614 AD, destroyed all the churches in the Holy Land. Okay? That means those built in the Byzantine church. After that, we have the Crusader church, 12th century. Crusader Church, a point the win of the Byzantine Church. And then, after that, this church it was destroyed. Destroyed. They came the Franciscan Anthony Bellucci yeah. another time. He built the church, a point the win of the Byzantine Church and the Crusader Church what we will visit now. We will enter to that church. It was built by Anthony Bellucci. We have three churches until now. Mount of Petitius, Cabernahum, Mount Tabor, Mount of Transfiguration. Okay? Okay. And Anthony Bellucci took the symbol from the Bible. Let us build the 310. He built the 310 to avoid the church. In the middle, the tent of Jesus, to the right, the tent of Elijah, to the left, the tent of Moses. We call that two tent Elijah and Moses, the shovel, uh, the shovel of Moses, shovel of Elijah. When you enter there, you will see to the side, from far away, to see a point, the top of the church, the three tent. And you will enter the shovel of Elijah and Moses, you will see Elijah paint there, Elijah, and you can click photo, and the other side, Moses. Where the rock that Jesus was transfigured, I will point to you, it is near the altar in that many church, it is covered with the glass. That's the rock there, where Jesus stands and the transfigured. Okay, that's what we are going now to see in Mount Tabor, Mount of Transfiguration. The high of Mount, Mount Tabor today, 585 meters above sea level. And it is not connect with the area, with the mountain in the area. It is separate, okay? It is separate mountain, not connect with the area. What we call it in geology, forest. Forest, that means like the horse. Something rise from up. Yesterday I told you about the rift. Today I told you to be balanced. That is, it is rise up. And that's what we call it for us. Okay? So what the rift we call them in geology, graven. Graven that means low land. Okay? See, Galilee graven. Part from the graven. Okay? And Mount Tabor, forest. Okay? So, something to learn about geology. Okay? Okay. Now, we're going now to see that in our way. Right side, that's the kibbutz. That's the one kibbutz in Israel, religion kibbutz. Right side. The building. This is known by the name Lavi. Lavi, that means lion in Hebrew. Lavi, lion in Hebrew. And that kibbutz, here the name, you can see that now, right side, Lavi. And this is the one kibbutz in Israel inhabited with the Orthodox Jews. Orthodox Jews, those who dress the black dress and the white shirt. Okay? Why? And they start to be engineers. And they said 
if they will return back to the kibbutz, because I meet them when we when I was studying at the university too. So if we return back, the kibbutz will take this salary uh, because he everything covered from the kibbutz. Yeah. So those young people. They left the parents, even they live in the kibbutz there, and they start to live in the cities and work there and earn money for themselves. Okay? So that's the way. Mount Tabor, right side. The church at the top, right side, that's the Catholic church what we will visit. Okay? Up. Up, up. Right side, okay? Right, I see it, not uh, direction different. Okay? Uh, yeah, we will go with the van, with the van, the bus cannot go there, you will see narrow road, curves, roads, etc. Dangerous, only for the, you know, the small van can uh, go, each van he will take between 10 to 13 passenger, up to up. We need the three van already, three or four, okay? Son of the lion in Arabic, Shibel, we call it. This uh, village, it is Arabic village, Bedouins original people, but according to the Israeli law, not allowed for the, not allowed. Uh, uh, before I continue, right side, this tree, fig tree, right side, here, 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 this one, this one, yeah, 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 fig tree. It is mentioned about the fig tree. Here, left also, another one. Okay? Yeah, there. That's figure three. Yeah. A T. Mariala. <laughs> okay. We, here, another one, right side. Okay. And left. Yeah, we reach now. Hello. Ayan three. Figure three. Ayan three, yeah, yeah, that's forest because the mountain, it is natural park, natural park, okay? So, we, uh, in a few minutes, we will take the van up to the Mount of Transfiguration. 
Okay, according to the Zerahilan law, Bedouins cannot move in the desert. Later I will explain the, that when we saw the Bedouins between from Jerusalem to our way from Jerusalem to Jericho. I will explain more about the Bedouins, Arab people. Okay, the village here right side up, Arabic village, but there the building, the high building in front of us a little bit at the top, Nazareth. Nazareth, yeah. Wow, this is nice. My city. Okay. Yeah, we will take the van oh. from here. Okay? They're waiting for us.
matinding adventure. Pag gusto mo tumira sa kibot dito,
Can you start? Yes. Yeah, okay. If you come uh, uh, here to that corner, please. Come to that corner. I will start to explain. Yeah, let them come to person there. Yeah. Come. Okay. Uh, may I have your attention, please, for uh, five minutes only to explain to you. Now, uh, when you went to the inside the church, that's the church that was built by into the building. Okay. So, uh, where the altar, before the altar, but you cannot see that because the people there, you must be very close. That's the rock to the left in the corner. That's the rock where Jesus is transfigured. Avoid. Okay, but then the mosaic inside the church, you saw everything, you click photo there. Now, about the view here. We will look to the other side there, the mountain there, Jordan, the kingdom of Jordan. You cross the border there, yeah. exactly, yeah. exactly there. Yeah. Yesterday, you cross the border there. Here, 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 the mountain there, what you see that far away there, mm -hmm. uh, windmill, a boy, yeah. okay, yeah. 12, 30, 8.30, okay, so, the, the, from there, mm -hmm. that's, when we exit from the border, few minutes, yeah, it was a city there, the name of the city, Beichan, Beichan, that city, it was built by King Saul. Oh, Saul, before David. King Saul, yeah, before okay? David. Why? Because I will connect the thing with the, what you see. You see the mountain here? Here the first. First, Gilboa. What it is mentioned in the history, King David came from the city of Echan. And he faced the Palestinian, the Palestinian, no, okay, Palestinian, and the battle, the battle took place at the foot of the Mount Gilboa. Okay, in that battle, King Saul was killed with the three sons by the Palestinian. Okay, and and. After King Saul, who came to be the king? David. Very good, David, King David. And what the meaning of, what the entrance of the uh, Palestinian, it was to occupy the Samaria area. Because behind the Gilboa, there is Samaria, the mountain there. And we continue Samaria, Judea. Oh. But I show you at the map, yellow yeah, color. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, the mountain there, Samaria, and they continue Judea. You cannot see Judea, but they continue, I mean. That's the direction. So the Palestinians, they want to occupy the mountain area. They occupied, they came from a creek, by the way, in the sea. Came to the area, it is near Gaza, Ashkelon. Okay, they, near. And they came to, through the sea coast, all that area where I told you that is busy with the population. You remember near the Mediterranean, and came to here. And they don't in that area when they came, they don't find population at that time, because the people ancient settlement it was above in the mountain, not on the plain area. Why? Because it is easy to defense the city or the settlement if when it is at the top, yeah. you can watch everything yes. and difficult to occupy. Yes. Okay, because of the mountain. Yes. Ancient uh, settlement in Galilee, 
in Samaria, Judea, it is upon the mountain, at the summit of the mountain. Okay, not in the valley. Okay, at that time. Now, they attempt to occupy that, but it happened like that. And uh, about Richan, here of the great here, also he built city there after what he uh, did in the, one of the Dika Bolis, Dika Ten, Bolis city. Ten cities it was built by Herod the Great. And if you uh, stay in Amman, I don't know if he mentioned for you, inside the Amman area where is the market, there is the city is built by Herod the Great also. It is the name Philadelphia. Yeah. Yeah. You, you, he show you? Yeah, yeah. Yes, yes. He show you? Yeah. The theater there? There in Jordan, in Amman. You show that? You saw that? No. Yeah. no. Okay, well, he yeah. not mention yeah. about it. Mention, mention. Okay, Philadelphia, Philadelphia, it is in Amman, the ancient city. It was built one of the, from the Decapolis, one from the 10 cities. It was built by Herod the Great. He built in Caesarea. A city, okay. Here the great. He built in Caesarea Maritima, Caesarea near the sea, Caesarea Philippi, near that where Jesus went with the disciples to there, near the Banias, at the foot of the Banias. Okay, that is the Caesarea Philippi. Philippi, following the name Philip Augustus. Okay, the emperor Philip Augustus. Anyway, so that's the Gilboa Mountain. So here it happened the battle between King Saul and the Palestinian. And he was killed with the three sons. King David came. Then he stopped the Palestinian not to occupy the mountain area. Okay? Not Samaria, not Judea. Now we will take a little bit here to the industrial area, what you see here. And there is a village at the mountain, not okay. at the top. At the mountain, beside that uh, industry area, you mm. saw that? Yeah. Yes. Uh, Direction, straight, yeah. industry mm. area that year mm. down. Little bit, we will saw that once again from the bus when we're driving to Nazareth. That's the village Naim. Naim. In the book of Luke chapter seven. It's mentioned that Jesus went there and he raised the widow's son. Jesus arrived, the widow's son was dead. Oh, and he arrived, okay, in Naim. In Naim. So, the, in Naim, there is a church today at the location where Jesus was the widow's son. Okay? Now, we will go from that village a little bit to the right and the straight. Straight behind the building. You see the last building? Yeah. No. The <laughs> to a lot of building. Hello? Uh, a lot of building. <laughs> many building. <laughs> many building. <laughs> Not only one. So many buildings. <laughs> okay. Once again. Once again. Uh, once again. You see that tree? This tree here? Yeah. <laughs> you see that? Yeah. Yeah. Go straight. Oh, straight there. Oh. Straight. Oh. You see the building? Last building. No. <laughs> no. I saw, but many building. <laughs> okay. And you see the mountain, okay? Yeah. Yeah, mountain. Too much. That mountain, Armageddon. Armageddon. Oh. Oh. Ah, That's Megiddo. what I want to know. Megiddo. <laughs> Armageddon, the last in the book of Revelation yeah. is mentioned there, mentioned there, that the last battle, chapter 16 of course, last battle will take place there. Mm, the king of the kingdom will come there and the last battle will take place there in Armageddon. Mm -hmm. Armageddon, Ar, that mean Har, Mount Megiddo. Mm -hmm. Okay? Ar, that mean Har Megiddo. Mm -hmm. Yeah, because King Solomon, in his period, he built 
a beautiful city in Armageddon. Okay, at the time of his son King Ahab, he built the tunnel of water to save water for that city, what we call it Megiddo. Megiddo. Yeah. Okay, but in the what the main thing important, the last battle will take place there. The kings of the, the king will come there. Last battle will take place there in Armageddon. Okay, now. If we go behind this building straight, there is another mountain. Okay? Oh, yes. Behind. Okay? And, and <laughs> 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 we got this one right now. <laughs> okay? There, that's Mount Carmel. Tomorrow oh, we will see Mount Carmel. Mount Carmel, okay. Yes. Yeah. Apparition of Blessed Big Man. Yeah, it's straight, straight. Go straight here. Yeah. Go you straight here. Yeah. Yeah. If you go there to the other side, oh. Galilee. Oh. Oh. Galilee. Oh. Galilee. Okay? Oh. Lower Galilee and, uh, and upper oh. Galilee. Galilee. Okay? Yeah. Now, important thing oh, you want to see. You see the man with the lady there? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> if you get there down, you will see the mosaic from the Byzantine church in oh. The wall there, Crusader Church, from the 12th century. So, it is 4th century, 12th century. Take photo, and that's the new church in 20th century. Thank you. Hi guys, and it's a good idea. I'm Ito rin, yung ibang klase, o. Ito ibang ano. Ito, okay lang. Ganun ba ba?